it's the most wonderful time of the year. It's the soapbox, the winter one. I'm so excited. Um, you guys know Fortune Cookie Soap is, I think, one of the best subscription services. If you aren't subscribed to it and you want to subscribe to something, this is the thing to subscribe to. It comes out four times a year. Let's go ahead and crack into it. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's Christmas elf themed. Oh, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Let's look at the contents. Um, Man, I just have been loving it. I actually signed up for the 12 Days of Christmas Fortune Cookie Soap box, and they're including 12 um, individually wrapped items inside. I believe that they're full-size items. I can't remember. It was $50, which is really pricey, but I've always, like, I love advent calendars, and I thought, like, I really always wanted to try more of their things and more of things that are full-size, but I've never been really willing to do it, so that would be a really great way to do it. So... Let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to like unwrap them each day and do like um, a video on Instagram or if you want me to wait until after Christmas and show you everything that I got. Um, let me know in the comments below and I will do whatever you guys want. Um, I'm not going to open them all at once though because I want to legit do it like it's getting ready for Christmas. But enough of the talk. Let's go ahead and discuss what's in this box. It says the 2015 Winter Soapbox and it looks like it is Buddy the Elf theme which is amazing. Um, first up we have the world's best cup of coffee. Um, no joke, Ben and I are obsessed with this movie. The musical is actually in town and we're thinking of going. If you have seen the musical, let me know your thoughts on it. Is it worth the price? Should we go see it? Should we not go see it? Ooh, this definitely has like a caramel coffee scent. How do they describe it? It says, um, you did it, congratulations. You can now smell like the world's best cup of coffee. Vermont maple syrup with just the right amount of fresh brewed coffee. Gotta get in all those food groups. Yeah. This is awesome. These are just great samplings. Next up, we have Cotton Headed Ninny Mungans. This is dry shampoo. Ooh, but it looks like it's like a powder, like baby powder dry shampoo. Mm-hmm. I'm pumped to try this. What does it have to say? Um, it says a refresh e floral, it's a word, trust us, blend that bursts with lilies, freesia, jasmine, and bayberry, muddled with fresh blackberries and plums, garnished with a sprig of peppermint. That's a lot of scents inside a dry shampoo, so I'm definitely going to try this out. I've never used a powder dry shampoo before, so I don't 100% know how to use it, but a little experimentation never hurt anybody. Um, we've got an OCD hand sanitizer. So excited. I'm getting very low on my little hand sanitizers. This is Swirly Twirly Gumdrops. I bet it's going to smell like Bubblicious. Let's go ahead and rub it in. And it says it's a sweet and whimsical blend of cotton candy, lemon drops, and fresh pear nectar. Love all of those things. Dancing with tart cranberries and black currants. Oh my gosh. If this is a perfume oil, I may need to snag me some. It smells so awesome. This is, oh, this is a really awesome scent. I like this one a lot. This might be my favorite scent out of this box so far. Next up we have um, a perfume oil. It's FCS Cheer. How do they describe it? Rich buttery vanilla pound cake over dark frankincense, patchouli, and cedar create a scent that's as warm and inviting as Christmas itself. Not my favorite. It has the frankincense cell smell pretty heavy in there, and I know what frankincense smells like because at my church, um, they do use frankincense there, and I don't want to smell like my church. But I don't mind the idea of it, and I will use it as like a nighttime perfume. I do like to put some perfume on before I go to bed. It's a thing. Um, now we have what looks like a little scoop of ice cream. This is a yellow snow bath bomb. It's a juicy blend of ripe plums, whipped caramel, vanilla jasmine, and exotic woods with just a squeeze of zesty mandarin oranges. It's soothing and revitalizing in one drop. That's awesome. Um, we've got the annual portion cookie soap, bar of soap. It's so adorable. Ooh, it smells fruity. It's got fruits, candy, crushed vanilla, and a hint of mint. This scent will have you feeling just as happy as everyone's favorite elf. What's my fortune? By the way, don't eat the yellow snow. Awesome. This is awesome. Um, I still have not used these yet, so I still can't comment on like how good of a soap this is because I'm just slowly working my way through other things. That's the one downfall is I don't ever really use the soaps. I eventually will, just not anytime soon. 
Um, they gave us a candy cane, which is broken. We have these little um, tablets. What are these for? It says Christmas Graham face plant. Uh, watch out, our new face plant might just have you singing I love you to virtual strangers at the office Christmas party. It's a warm, steamy air, fresh with lavender and sea salt spray, mingle with the woody earthiness of sage and dark vanilla. It says to use, fill bowl or sink with very hot water, drop in two to three tablets, so I have two uses here. Dra drape a towel over your head and bowl slash sink, let the pour opening steam refresh in tone with sea salt and calming lavender. I've never heard of this before, but I will give this a whirl. It sounds kind of weird, slash I'm skeptical about it, but um, it's a sample, so whatever. And the last thing we have is this little guy. It's a shower duet. I don't, oh, it's a shave oil. I've never used a shave oil, actually. Um, it says spruce and vanilla, fur and fruits, hitch and mint. We've created a shave oil guaranteed to warm up your coldest winter nights. It says to use wet skin with warm water, massage small amount, three to five drops into the area to be shaved, allowing oils to soften hair and skin. Shave as usual, rinsing razor, often rinse and enjoy. Oh, it smells good. I've never heard of a shaving oil before. I mean, it makes sense, there are oils for everything, but really cool. So there are some definitely some unique products in here. We've got the face tablets, the oil, the powder, dry shampoo, um, and the rest of the stuff is pretty typical, but I love this theme. They did have the um, winter party, launch party a couple of days ago. So all of these products that they made in full size versions are on their website. Definitely something where if you like this theme and you like some of the notes I mentioned in these scents, pick these up. They are a great company. Everything is handmade. They are uh, very much of a, an indie brand, but their things are such good quality and I freaking love them. Um, so that's it for me guys. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.